Hey everyone, I'm Lauren here at La Valencia Hotel. We're in the Med Ocean View restaurant and I'm here with our executive chef, James Monahano, who's gonna do uh, one more demonstration for us. What do you got for us today? Okay, so today we're gonna be doing a Hudson Valley foie gras torchon. So right here I wanted to show you the uh, foie gras. So this is a whole liver that I've separated, deboned, and take out the, the, the veins out of it, put it back together. We use a little touch of cognac, some curing salt, and some regular salt. And then we let it sit for about 24 hours. Then I remold it, I shape it, I blanch it, and then I re-roll it in cheesecloth and we let it hang for another 24. So it's a little process, but now that foie gras is back, you know, we love to have, we have it on the menu here and it's just, it's a great signature dish that I'm gonna show you is our foie gras torchon appetizer. So if you give me a second here, I can put great. it together for you. Yeah, let's see. All right, so we have, uh, first of all, we have this beautiful duck prosciutto. So it's duck and foie. So if I can get this off my paper here, that I slice ever so I've never gently. seen prosciutto that small. Do you do you cut it that size? Oh yeah, we, th we slice this thin to win. So here we go. I got the uh, duck prosciutto. Now I have my foie gras torchon that's here that I've thinly sliced. It's a little soft because it's been sitting out, but we'll get that on there. I have a little uh, fennel sea salt here that gives it a little seasoning on top. I have some beautiful uh, pear that we're going to garnish our little salad, duck prosciutto salad here. So I'm going to add the pear to the side. I have a, some microgreens, not microgreens, I'm sorry, uh, some um, frisee and some uh, organic uh, pepper crust that's going to go on top here. It's going to accent. So I have it sitting there. That looks beautiful. I have some beautiful uh, fig jam that I've made here. The figs are just at the end of the season, but I made this about a month ago, so it sits pretty well. So I'm going to sit this here in the middle. People, people are asking, Chef, where you get the fennel and the sea salt and the different ingredients. Uh, the fennel pollen is a local fennel pollen. The sea salt is coming out of France. So what I do is I take the fennel pollen and I infuse it together with the, with the, the sea salt, and I make my own little seasoning for it. So here I have this uh, beautiful peach, Indian peach uh, puree. It's like a, it's like a pureed uh, chutney that I made. These peaches are beautiful. They're, they're organic. They come from Frog Hollow up in Northern California. So it's basically like a, a, a chutney puree. It has a great, great flavor. So here we're going to put this on the plate. This is going to accent the foie gras with the salad. Then I have some port wine that I reduced down with sugar. So we're going to give some dots here from large small. That's going to go great with this dish. Here I've toasted off some brioche croutons that are going to eat with the foie gras. So we put those gently on the plate. We'll accent with this. this is a very classic French style dish. So you're going to kind of make your own sandwich you know, What you want to do is you want to either put the smear of the foie and, and, and the jam onto the, uh, onto the toast. So I have some of these uh, Fresh Origins microgreens that were grown here locally in San Diego. So this is a, a combination of some fine herbs, some chervil, some uh, chives, some aromath in there. Nice little accent. So is this a, a starter appetizer or? This is one of our new signature fall dishes that's on the menu. So it's our foie gras torchon, our Indian peach puree, fig jam, port wine reduction, duck prosciutto with some uh, brioche, Toast points, two turntables and a microphone. Looks so let's great. bring it over to the folks here. I'm gonna have my yeah. my sampler here. Yolanda is gonna try this, see what she thinks. We got some great other dishes that are on our fall menu. We have our beet splash salad. It's a beet creme fraiche with some nice Bartlett pears with some poached pear on there. And if you look at this right here, this is a, a, a freeze dried white balsamic. That's excellent little crispy on the dish. Why don't you take a little taste of that, Leo? Just grab a little, no, just with your fingers, pick that up. A little crunch. Do you taste the vinegar? White balsamic? Mm. Wow. Delicious. So it really accents the salad. The lovely Rita has our hamachi tartare. We have a black garlic aioli with avocado yuzu mousse. And then the hamachi is on there. Look at that, taking a big old bite. With a light shoyu, shoyu mustard sauce. I mean, it really accents the, two, the, the, the flavor of the fish. The, the yellowtails coming straight out of uh, Japan. Look at... Yolanda, she's has, she ain't scared. She's going straight for the foie gras. <laughs> then we have our other signature dish. This is a 
our grilled Mediterranean octopus, humamara sauce with a fig and olive uh, vinaigrette with some uh, oven roasted tomatoes and king trumpet mushrooms. It's got some really different great flavors going on here. Uh, one thing about the hotel is we are a hotel restaurant, but don't be afraid to come and enjoy the food here because just because we're a hotel doesn't mean the, the food isn't great. If we were a stand-up restaurant, people would be coming in. This is one what you experience when you come to La Valencia that you can have great, great meal here. We have two beautiful restaurants. You have this ocean view terrace. It's unbelievable. This hotel is iconic, and I highly suggest you come check it out. Come check me out. Hit me up. And our chef is iconic, too, by the way. He won the, last year um, the San Diego Bay Wine and Food Festival, the chef of the fest, and hopefully this year we'll be taking home uh, another award as well. So definitely come check us out. We're here in La Jolla, La Valencia Hotel. Thanks for tuning in. All right. Bon appetit.